on our way to New York. Is it focused on me? Oh, I can feel it. So we are on our way to NYC. The plane just started moving. I'm so excited. We're going to take off. Everyone's saying how humid it is, and this is nothing compared to Florida. That's absolutely right. Feels a lot better here. Feels way better here. And there's like this amazing breeze that we don't have in Florida either. In Florida, it's like still hot, muggy heat. I swear, people have to watch me vlogging and being like, who the hell does this woman think she is? She does not need to be filming herself walking across the street. Obviously. We made it to the hotel. There's something in here too. I swear to God, if I did not create champagne pop, someone would think I have a serious alcohol problem. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, look at this scary ass balcony. Are you kidding? Absolutely not. Both I want to see. <laughs> Oh my gosh, you have to tell me not. You're so funny. I'm not going out there. She's <laughs> I'm not doing it, no. <laughs> no, that's too much. I flew today. I'm done conquering my fears for the next 24 hours. I love the furnishing. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like it's a cheesecake. Oh my god! It's New York cheesecake. It's Are a whole kidding? cheesecake. I need a close of this. Uh, <laughs> why are you doing this to me, Becca? Okay, fine. Oh okay, my fine. gosh. Okay, fine. <laughs> You're amazing. <laughs> this cookie is good, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Becca is trying to fatten me up. <sighs> I have an hour to relax and just chill, and then we are going to a little cocktail party that Becca set up for us, which is very exciting. So. I'm going to relax for the next hour and eat. I ordered a salad because I'm trying to be healthy. Let's see how all that goes, right? So yeah, I'm just gonna lay here for a little bit and call John. You can see the shirt that Becca got me. Isn't that cute? Champagne campaign, I love it. And what's funny is I have this shirt, not the sweatshirt, but I have a shirt that says this as well that I love. So it's cute that they got the sweatshirt. I love it. Hey, babe. Hey, baby, what's up? Nothing, what are you doing? I made it to the Big Apple. And? <laughs> What's up? Not much. We just got to our hotel a few minutes ago and Becca left us all kinds of gifts. It was so sweet. So we walked into the hotel room and there's like cheesecake, like New York cheesecake. And like they gave us like three matching sweatshirts that say champagne campaign. And they got us a bottle of champs and it was so sweet. No so yeah. Way. That's awesome. I know. Well, just text, call me tonight or text me. I will. All right. Bye. All right. Bye. Oh, oh, yummy. So my makeup is done. Ooh. My makeup is done for the event tonight. Oh, hey, there I am. <laughs> um, my makeup is done now, but I have not gotten changed yet because I still have like another 25 minutes. And I'm going to relax for the next 22 minutes and then get changed at the last second. But I actually um, hate my makeup right now. Ooh, I look so like big back there in the mirror. Like I look like this big scary blob. It's like gonna come get you in your sleep. Okay, that's creepy. Anyways, um, but yeah, like I had to touch up my makeup from the plane, so it's not fresh. So I don't feel like you know what I'm saying. I feel like mm, I know you understand me. I know you get me. That's why I love you. That's why you're my people. And I have been doing so well at eating healthy the past few days i have been living off of like healthy fats and like low carbs and what else have i been doing no sugar i've been doing so well and just in three days time i can already see like my tummy just flattening just a little bit because i've like deprived myself of everything that i normally eat and then i come into the hotel and i see these i see these and i've already had five no shame. Mom's Hi. in the background. Mom was like, <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to New York. This is Bob. He is the president of Becca. Hey, what's happening? So we good to see you all. 
Yeah. Now we all know what on fleek means. I had no idea. Right? <laughs> Are you going to do your happy dance with them? Happy dance. Happy yeah! Dance. <laughs> Look how beautiful. Say hi, Mom. Hi. <laughs> so freaking bright. It is bright, I know. <laughs> the day of the meet and greet. I'm so excited. I've never I've never done a meet and greet this big before. Not like in quantity of people, but in quality. I've never done a meet and greet like with Sephora in Union Square in New York City. It's just I feel like when I get there, I'm gonna cry. I'm preparing to just bawl my eyes out. I keep telling my mom and my sister, like, make sure that you're like joking around with me and laughing because I know I'm gonna walk in there and I'm just gonna start bawling. This is just the most surreal moment to date. And I'm so happy that you guys are gonna come with me. I'm so excited. It's raining and I feel so bad because I have subscribers waiting in line right now and it's raining and I feel so bad. And I. And I asked Becca, I was like, can you guys go out there and give them umbrellas or something? Like, oh, it sucks that you guys, I am shaky. Can you see my hand shaking? I'm like shaky because it's raining and I feel so bad that some people are gonna be outside and, oh. <laughs> I just got back from my meet and greet and I'm gonna warn you that I might cry. Um, I've been crying all day. Do you hear how raspy my voice is just from like wearing myself out so much? Um, I just wanted to take a moment just to say thank you because I have moments like this quite often but I never actually document it and vlog it. So I just wanted to take advantage of this moment and just thank you guys personally from the bottom of my heart. 
Um, today was a meet and greet at Sephora, as you guys saw, and it was, <sighs> it was just like the most magical, loving filled day I've ever had in my life. And I'm just, I'm just so ridiculously grateful for you guys. You really have no idea. And I just have to give a personal thank you to everybody who came and not just the people who came, the people who wanted to be there and the people who just take time to support me and just, <laughs> I just really feel like the luckiest girl in the entire world because of you guys, I swear. Um, anyways, I need to get myself together like right now. <laughs> I have no joke been crying ever since I left the meet and greet. I'm really good at keeping it together and holding it in like in front of you guys. But like the second I got in the car, I just started bawling. Uh, I just, I'm just overwhelmed. I have to make a confession and that is I allow the haters to get to me a lot. I'm not one of those people because they can just say like, screw the haters. I don't care what they have to say. Um, I have an obsessive need to please everybody. And when I see people leaving mean comments or making accusations about my life, it gets to me and it affects me. And it dictates like the way I act on YouTube because I can just like freak out sometimes. But today after meeting hundreds of you guys, just really loving me for me and just being so emotionally beautiful, it was just... <laughs> like I don't give a shit about the people who have negative things to say anymore you guys have just given me so much inspiration because so many of you guys today just knew me for who I was and so many of you just had such beautiful things to say and I'm just so grateful for you guys like I really am I just love you so much and I really just wanted to say thank you just thank you to everybody for coming for supporting me and I posted a photo on Instagram of um, me and Sephora I am so sorry you guys, I'm crying this much. I know it's probably very obnoxious to watch on camera, but this is how I'm feeling. And after today, like I really don't care who sees me cry because it's just like, ah. Uh. Let me show you real quick. Of me standing next to my face. It's like this huge, like seven foot poster of myself in Sephora. It there's just so many comments from you guys just telling me how you're so proud of me and I just deserve this and it's, it's overwhelming that I just have so many of you who are just such great people and I hear from you guys all the time I deserve this so much and I just have to say like you guys that leave these amazing comments to me and tell me how proud you are of me like you guys deserve great things too and I hope you know that like I just I love you and I'm just so grateful like it's just crazy that that photo is my most liked photo that photo is the one that you guys are so happy and excited about like you're happy to see me grow it's just crazy so I'm sorry that I am a babbling mess seriously like I really do want to apologize um I just keep thinking and I keep saying to everybody like I just don't know how to repay you guys for everything that you've done for me and honestly the only thing that I can really come up with is that I promise you right here and now that I will never sell out. I promise you that I will never lie to you. I promise you that I will never put money above my relationship with my subscribers. I promise you that I will stay true to myself and I will stay true to you. I promise you that I will only talk about things that I genuinely love. I promise you. You guys know how much I love you and you guys mean the world to me. I have never felt better in my whole life and that is because of you. No money. No collaboration, no highlight can ever make me feel the way I feel right now. And that is all because of my subscribers. You guys are seriously the most beautiful people inside and out that I've ever known in my life. And I am just, I'm just so blessed to have you guys. I'm sorry for being Mrs. Nipples. <laughs> okay, it's time to wash my face now. So fresh and so clean. It is time to go home. This trip went by so quick. It was less than 48 hours, like in and out. And oh, oh my God, I'm gonna smack myself in the face. I woke up today feeling just so like <gasps> euphoric inside and just so excited because yesterday was just so great and I'll never forget it, ever. Wait, is this too dark now? Okay, so we are just about to leave for the airport, but my sister got a tweet saying that someone has been waiting outside my hotel since 9 a.m. to meet me. And I'm trying to find her right now. Hi! <laughs> this is Brooke. She has been here with her friends since 9 a.m. It's 1.30. Well, she had to be in the video. So Highlight on the Highlight on the <laughs> Not today, but most days, most days. She's on fleek. <laughs>